Hi, good evening, guys. Today we're gonna have steamboat. It's because it's Friday and it's my daughter buffet. Welcome to my channel on the Friday evening in North Sweden. So, what are we going to have today? Steamboat. I'm sure you guys have. Uh, Notice that that is my favorite food. So I'm going to just quickly share with you uh, what are the ingredients we need. So I have brought this, it's called a fish cake. I'm sure those of you who've been to Singapore, you have tried this, it's really nice. It's actually fish cake that has been fried. So this is going to be dipped into a broth or you can fry them on a pan. And then I have some Singapore fish balls. Uh, and then I have some tofu, which is slightly firm, and some, this is called soccer atto. What do you call this? Chickpeas. No, not sweet. Sweet peas, right? So I like this when it's boiled, and even when it's fried, I think it's really nice. So we're going to eat in this really nice big Korean grill. And the same here, tofu, because my daughter is a vegetarian, half vegetarian, so I think she will like this. So beef, I have seasoned this with uh, goju jiang uh, and some um, sesame seed. So it's very simple, goju jiang, sesame seed and a little bit of oil, a little bit of uh, soya, that's it. And over here I have this, what we call uh, pork, that is... Uh, very thin slices so Korean people they like to eat a lot of this so I'm gonna eat this also it's slightly salty and it's really nice if you grill them on a on a hot plate and of course tomato always good and for the sauce I have actually made um no I have a noodles too this is the potato noodles uh, I like this a lot this is like almost translucent so almost translucent yeah so this is actually very very nice if you are eating steamboat uh, and also i have some sauce ingredients i'm going to share with you one of my favorite mix that is with the sesame paste this is uh, from the asian supermarket if you can get this Try and find this. It's really nice if you are eating steamboat. And I usually like to mix them with the hoisin sauce and a little bit of sriracha and a little bit of soya. Uh, and hi, welcome. And I have mixed them together with some soy sauce and then I add some sesame seed and some scallions. So this will be our dipping sauce for the steamboat or you some people know this as hot pot so this is our dinner for today and uh of course you know me i cannot live without chili so this is a chili paste that i bought it's a loca ma one of my favorite brand so usually i like to dip them in this chili sauce oh what happened here hmm I think my daughter is coming soon. Uh, today is her birthday, so I she loved this dish, and I think uh, this is will be a very nice uh, meal for her. And I'm going to be man free for five days because LG just left me <laughs> here alone in Sweden, um, and he have gone for some competition. So I will be without him for five days and I am kind of feeling so relaxed now because I don't have to rush for making dinner so I can do it on my own face. So the stocks, you probably wonder what is the stocks, right? So guys, if you remember, I always am the lazy person, you know, I always like to make a uh, lazy sauce. So let me just see if I can find a spoon so that I can scoop up. Uh, it's actually a tom yum so soup that uh, I have used of the beef to cook uh, into a broth. And then I use this instant tom yum uh, 
broth. So I'm going to add some lime juice in this. So it's going to be really, really uh, sour because uh, that's the purpose of the song yam paste. You have to add a little bit of your own lime juice. So this is going to be in the middle of our hot plate as a broth. And at the side, you can grill them. And I'm sure you remember how my Korean grill look like, right? So I'm going to try and take picture and I'm going to share with you guys later on. And let's see if I can give you more guys more tips. Tips number one. Don't have to be complicated because if you go make it complicated, adding too much marinade, you're going to spoil this. Try and keep it simple like this one. I think this is a slightly salted. You don't really need to do anything about that. Right? The key is keep it simple. The flavors has to be clean. And then that is where you can enjoy the real flavors. So I make myself a Coca-Cola rum. And I'm going to enjoy while waiting for my daughter to come. And um, I can't wait to spend the evening with her. And it feels so good because this is the first birthday after so many years that I can finally spend time with her alone. And she is all mine tonight. And I'm so happy. Mm, cheers, guys. Happy Friday. And thanks God. It's a sunny weather. Swante and Siri is sitting outside. No, they are not outside. They are sitting on the window. Hi, Swante. You want to say hello to our audience? No, Hugh? Yeah, I got Hugh. Swante is a good boy, right? So it's a very, very nice weather outside. It's perfect weather for barbecue. But, you know... We are two ladies, so we're not going to do barbecue. We're just going to just sit in the house, open the door and the window and let our neighbors smell our delicious food and feel jealous. And then, you know, just mellow down. Maybe listen to a music or maybe, you know, watch a movie. So I think this is... Uh, and then spend our time with these two cats, right? So, I think that is a bird, the best, best birthday gift my daughter can get from me. Uh, you probably wonder why she's not with her boyfriend, right? So, which is really kind of uh, disappointing because he has made arrangement with his friend and they're going for movies. But I think it's good because then I get a chance to be my with my daughter alone. I have her all by myself. I don't share with anyone. So I have bought her some gift. This is a aloe shh. This is a aloe vera plant which I bought today. Actually, I made a mistake. I should have bought two. I I wasn't thinking, you know, like too stressed out. So I bought just one. In fact, I'm going to buy her another one. And I gave her a, a before birthday present just like one month ago. So I think she should be happy. So now I'm just going to set the table. The table is empty. I'm going to put a tablecloth on top. And then I'm going to put the grill on top. And we're going to open some window so that the cat uh, have somewhere to run around no the door is open let's see the door is open yeah yep it's open so they can run freely so now live streaming on cooking today i'm just going to uh lock up now so that i can get myself dressed up i dress up just with this green dress today and with slipper <laughs> Not really well dressed for a party, but you know, it's just two of us chill out and I'm so glad that her boyfriend didn't come and join us so that we can enjoy our time together, our quality time, yeah? Sometimes it's not a bad thing. Sometimes it's really, really nice that, you know, it's just two of us. So guys, if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and don't forget... 
to subscribe if you're new here. Uh, if you haven't, you know, then you better do it now. All right, click onto the link there and subscribe. And if you'd like to support our channel, we have a Patreon page in the video description where you could contribute as little as $1 to keep this channel running and going. And thank you, Johnny, for upgrading from $1 a month to $5 a month. Johnny, thank you so much. And this really means a lot to me. You know, even though I only have one Patreon, you know, I still feel like, hey, God, this guy upgrade from $1 to $5, you know, it means something. It means a lot to me. It means that this channel is worthwhile investing. So I hope you guys can be my investor and invest in my channel. And if you think that my food and my content give value to you and to the world and to other people, I would really, really appreciate that you support our channel and that is one of the way yet that you can do it. And the other way is all the things that we use in our video, I'm beginning to put in the text and the link for products like, you know, like this, for example. I have this in my Amazon store. So I'm going to include the link where you could click and order. This is nothing, you know, this is nothing. This is really, really small money. Maybe I just earn 10 cents from this if you're going to order from Amazon to me. You know, they paid really, really low commission. So on a long term, I really, really need you guys uh, as a support so that, you know, my channel can stay and not disappear. You don't want my channel to disappear, right? And I hope that this would be like a passion uh, turning into a passive income for me, for my old age, yeah? So, enjoy your weekend, and I hope to see you again in my next live streaming.